What is going on everyone? I'm Chris Ewings. Welcome back to another video. So today I've made it out to a spot I haven't fished before out in Port Stephens. So I'm just near Lemon Tree Passage. So it's looking like a pretty good spot to fish. I did a little bit of Google Maps research and saw that there's some oyster leases, some mangroves and some good sand flats. So today the plan is to be chasing some brim, some flatty. I've got all my light setups on the kayak today. So let's get out there, see what we can get. All right, so like I said in the intro, I've uh, never fished out here before. So I'm pretty much just gonna paddle around and see what we can find. I might head over to the oyster leases, cast around there. It is smack bang on high tide, so the water isn't really moving at the moment. So I might have a bit of a slow start to the morning, but there's a few boat holes around here, a few rocks over there. It's looking like a really good spot to fish. So I'm thinking while I've got a bit of cloud cover, I'm gonna throw some surface and see if we can get any brim on the top water. So, I do have this bent minnow tied on. This is the 86 with a rattle. So I think we might try that out first and see what we can get. I've been pretty keen to get out here. It's actually been pretty chilly this morning. I've got the jacket on, middle of summer. So, let's see how we can go. It's a good bit of rock formation up here in front of me. So I'm gonna cast around that, see what we can get. I think that was just a boil around it. I just turned around to look what was around me. Yep, there is. Smack it a few times. Just keeps missing it. And he's back on it. Every time I turn away, he hits it. Wow, they never took it. It's crazy. So I've had a lot of follows, a lot of hits. So I've got one now, but I'm just not hooking up. There we go. Ah, oh, I dropped him. I saw a nice brim sitting right on that rock wall. So I just stopped the lure right on top of the rock. He came out and smacked it. Oh, I didn't get a good hook set though. It's a good start at the morning. Let's get this lure back in there. I saw two brim hiding in there and I'm pretty sure the smallest one went for the lure. Oh, that bird, these birds are going for my lure. <laughs> I must have just pulled that out of its beak. That was lucky. <laughs> oh. All right, let's see how we go with this style of spike. Let's see if we can get them to commit to something that's right in their face. Something they don't have to come up to the surface and hit. Cast it near these rocks. Try to get this lure to come over the top of them and see if we can get these brim. I believe we are on. We are onto a fish. He's not really fighting, but he's got a bit of weight to him. What is that? I just saw it come out to the surface. With these head shakes, I'm going to say flatty. But he just jumped out of the water, so I'm hoping this isn't a pike. It is a nice size flatty. There we go, that didn't take long in the dial spike. Ah, here we go. First fish of the morning, it, it is a solid flatty. Oh, he just went crazy in the net. Oh, that, is a, that is a good start to the morning. He's got a fair bit of weight to him. All right, calm down. Wow, that is a solid flatty. He did not put up a fight at all. So there is the first fish of the morning, guys. That is a solid 60 centimeter flatty. So that's pretty good there. That's on the die with spike. 
So let's get a few pictures and get it back in the water. Just gotta wait for it to be ready. Wait for it to kick and then let him go. There he goes, he's ready. Slowly swimming off. There we go. That is a good start to the morning, guys. I'm pretty happy with that. Let's head over to the oyster racks and see what we can catch over there. Hopefully get on a few fish before this rain settles in. Managed to catch a flatty right at the kayak. Looks like he's going to be mid 40s. He he chased that all the way back because I felt quite a few taps. Just wasn't too sure what it was. <sighs> Finally caught another fish. This is on the Daiwa spike. I've been casting quite a few lures around, just seeing if I can get something. It seems like the Daiwa spike is the one that's working today. Let's get him in the net. So he's not huge, but he's another flatty for the day. There we go. So he, come on, mate. Let's see if we can get a little bit bigger. Off you go. So it seems like the Daiwa spike is the lure that's working for me today. So I might, I might just keep casting this. I've been letting the current push me down along all these mangroves. I wasn't having much luck in the mangroves and I've just come out in the open. That's when I've uh, caught that flatty. Oh yes, he hasn't destroyed my line either. Now we're sitting roughly around that 1.6 meter mark. And I'm just slowly retrieving this Daiwa spike back to the kayak. But yeah, like I said, I felt him hit it a few times, but I just wasn't sure if it was the bottom. And uh, just as that lure started to come back up to the, the surface is when that flatty hit it. Yep. Oh, I think we're on again. I don't think he knows he's hooked just yet, but what is this? It's got a bit of weight to it. I'm gonna say another flatty. Here we go. <laughs> oh, this one sounds pretty good. He's going straight for those mangroves though. Yeah, he's feeling pretty good. <laughs> oh man, he's going straight to those mangroves. Let's see if we can get some line on him. He's just come to the surface, I just saw him. He's gone back down, I think. Might be another flatty. He had a few head shakes, so I'd say it is. Where are you? Oh, he wants to go again. He's a good fight in a flatty, this one. He's pulling me straight into the mangroves though. I'm coming in pretty quick. Just gonna back out. Haven't got a good look at him yet. Come on up you come. Yeah, that's another solid flatty. Be in the fifties, I think. He's just not ready to come up just yet. Come on, there he is. Oh, maybe that's bigger than the one this morning. Just taking it easy. I'm only using four pounds straight through fluorocarbon. It's a very light setup, this one. Not really meant for flatties, but still, it's really good fun. Yeah, he's a solid flatty. He might be bigger than the one this morning. Just not ready. Oh, that was lucky I didn't lose him at the net just then. He's actually bigger than the net. Go on, he's tired. There we go, he's in. Ah, oh, yes. Oh, yep, she is much bigger. She is sitting on 65 centimeters as a solid flatty. Pretty decent head on her. There it is guys, 65 centimetres. Another solid flatty for the morning. Oh, this is good fun. <laughs> Let's get it back in the water now.
she's straight off to the bottom. She was ready to go. That is awesome, guys.